Hey, welcome to a new video. Spiders can be found in almost every corner of the world. With over 45,000 known species varying in size, they inhabit diverse habitats, from rainforests of South America to sand dunes of Australia and even in our own homes. Although many spiders are harmless to humans and actually beneficial to the ecosystem by regulating insect populations, there are about a few hundred known species that can potentially be dangerous. Today we'll show you 25 encounters with spiders that you should better avoid. Are you new to the channel? Make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell. And before we start, also like the video. Number 25. In a world where the unusual sometimes is the norm, 2021 exceeded all expectations with a phenomenon that even the toughest Australians found spine-tingling. After a deluge of rain, an ominous sea of spiders emerged, crawling from the saturated earth in a desperate search for refuge. These spiders found solace in forming a gigantic creepy web blanket that stretched across the entire continent, from the lush treetops to the familiar street signs. This video was recorded in New South Wales revealing the true extent of this spider reign. As floods ravaged the East Coast, everyone had no choice but to flee. The result was an outside world transformed into a realm of spiders. Another courageous resident showed his backyard fence had become almost invisible under a carpet of spiders. Number 24. Imagine this. You're stranded in the wilderness of the Dominican Republic, surrounded by the serene beauty of Cruz de Rio Verde. But then, in a sudden twist, you are disturbed by a terrifying encounter with a giant spider. Out of nowhere, the colossal spider appeared, running at a speed that quickened your heart. However, this was no ordinary spider. It's a gigantic specimen that seems to come straight out of your nightmares. The British tourists in their jeep were helpless when their vehicle refused to start, and from the tall grass, a massive spider emerged, curious and quite unafraid. The Dominican Republic, known for its rich biodiversity, hosts several spider species, including some of the largest in the world. The most remarkable among them is the Hispaniola and giant tarantula, the largest in the Caribbean with legs that can span up to almost 8 inches or 20 centimeters. These hairy creatures, known for their striking colors, are a marvel to behold. From a safe distance, of course. Although the spider in the video posed no immediate danger, their appearance is enough to send shivers down every of the bravest spines. Number 23. In the mysterious world of arachnids, there's one creature that astonishes even the most seasoned nature enthusiasts, the whip spider. This amazing creature, neither a true spider nor a scorpion, has the unique distinction of being described by National Geographic as a non-spider, with pincers equipped with sharp teeth. A group of researchers, driven by curiosity, decided to conduct a fascinating experiment. They took a whip spider, placed it 33 feet or 10 meters away from its home tree, and observed. The goal was to see how this extraordinary being would find its way back. What followed was a stunning demonstration of orientation and survival instinct. You can find whip spiders in dark human places like caves and tropical rainforests. Their front pair of legs have evolved into long whip-like antenna, which they use to detect prey, explore the surroundings, and communicate. But perhaps the most striking thing about these creatures is their hunting technique. They use their antenna resembling grasping tongs to capture their prey or tear their food apart with alarming efficiency. Number 22. Picture a peaceful walk through a wooded area, the silence only interrupted by the gentle rustling of leaves. But then an unusual sight, a tree that appears to be covered in a thick layer of hair. Curiosity takes over, and you decide to investigate the strange phenomenon further. The man in the video picks up a small twig to see what the hairy tree is, and soon realizes that it's thousands of spiders. This tree was found somewhere in Guerrero, a state in Mexico. Guerrero is known for its diverse landscapes ranging from coastlines to mountains, providing an ideal habitat for various spider species. While most spiders in Guerrero are harmless to humans, there are some species, such as the Black Widow, whose bite can potentially be dangerous. These spiders are masters at weaving, and use silk to create intricate webs, serving as traps for unsuspecting prey and as shelters. These silken structures, though delicate, accumulate over time, especially in areas where spiders thrive. Number 21. This next person walked into his room and suddenly saw a shadow crawling over the wall. At first, he was terrified, but upon closer inspection, he realized there was a giant spider in the corner of the room, and not just any spider. This creature is as big as his dog, with legs that extend like branches. This is the infamous leave your house as quickly as possible spider, a creature so frightening that just the sight of it's time to pack your bags. This spider is said to have been found somewhere in Trinidad and Tobago, a country in the Caribbean off the coast of Venezuela. It's a Trinidad Chevron Tarantula and belongs to the family of orb-weaving spiders. But it's not just their appearance that intrigues. 
They are masters at web building, creating cone-shaped structures to trap unsuspecting prey. They specialize in hunting flying insects, and their attacks is as swift as it is ruthless. With a flash of silk, they immobilize their prey, followed by a deadly bite, after which they devour their catch. So what would your reaction be upon seeing this monster in your room? For many of us, including me, the simple answer would be run. Number 20. Imagine you're on a car ride headed to a birthday party, but before you know it, you find yourself in a scene from a horror movie. In this video, we see a family from Australia sitting in their car, when one of them suddenly spots a large spider crawling on the inside of their car. As you can guess, this immediately triggers a wave of panic. Screams fill the small space as the family trapped in their vehicle confronts their worst nightmare. In another video, an Australian woman is driving home alone, focused on the road, when she sees movement out of the corner of her eye. Instead of stopping, she keeps driving, paralyzed by fear and her heart pounding. There, on the ceiling of her car, was a huge, terrifying spider, and for 20 minutes, she continued to drive, while her unwanted passenger roams above her. Number 19. Unfortunately, little is known about this next video, but we see a man holding a camera and spotting something big and terrifying inside a hole in the ground. If this is anywhere near your home, it would likely give you a big scare, as you know how many more spiders might be present. In the video, the person tries to touch the enormous spider at one point, and you can see it slowly moving away. Some people in the comments, however, claim that the creature is not a spider, but a crab, specifically a coconut crab. They're the largest land-dwelling anthropods in the world. They're mostly found on islands in the Indian and Pacific Oceans, including Australia, Indonesia, Japan, and the Philippines. What do you think this person captured on camera? Could it be a giant spider or perhaps a coconut crab? Let me know in the comments. Number 18. This is Tom Buchanan, an Australian boy who achieved the record for the most spiders on his body in 2005. Yeah, you heard that right. Most people wouldn't want to experience this even in their worst nightmares, but Tom voluntarily allowed 125 Nephila spiders to crawl over his body, earning him a spot in the Guinness World Records. However, there's only one other man who even went further. Daniel Javanowski had 200 Chilean rose tarantulas walk on his body for 30 seconds on Italian television. The mere idea probably gives you the creeps. He appeared on the television show Lo Show de Record, a program famous for its bizarre and extraordinary record attempts. This moment was not only a test of courage, but also a fascinating glimpse into the human spirit and how far someone will go for fame. Number 17. This man from Australia was looking for the light switch when he suddenly stumbled upon a nest of huntsman spiders. But that's not all, he discovered even more. If you look closely, you'll see behind the spider's nest a gigantic mother spider, likely guarding her nest. These spiders don't build nests in the way you might expect. Instead, they choose surprising locations like walls or door frames. Normally, they prefer natural hiding spots like tree bark, leaves, or rocks, but they also use man-made structures. After laying eggs, the female usually stays near the egg sac to guard and protect it until the baby spiders hatch. During this period, she can react aggressively to any potential threat near her nest, including humans. And then comes the worst part. After the baby spiders hatch, they disperse from the nest and each goes its own way, searching for its own hiding spots and hunting grounds. Number 16. In this next video, we see some people taking a boat ride when they suddenly encounter something creepy. This incident was captured in Samara, a city in Russia located nearly a thousand kilometers east of Moscow. Here, the Samara River flows into the Volga River, the longest river in Europe with a length of almost 2,200 miles, or 3,530 kilometers. As they approached the bridge, they encountered an approximately 6.5 foot or 2 meter long mutated spider resting on the side of the bridge. Unfortunately, it's unclear whether this spider is real or not. But could you imagine if this encounter happened at night? In the dim light, you might almost believe it's a creature from another world. However, as they continue to sail, they realize that there are several large spiders on the bridge. This is the kind of encounter that will stay with them for a long time, especially if they're afraid of spiders. Number 15. This milking refers to the process of carefully extracting venom from spiders in a controlled and safe manner. It involves gently stimulating the spider's fangs to release venom which is then collected for further use. The obtained venom is used in the production of antivenom. Antivenom is a treatment that contains specific antibodies capable of neutralizing the effects of venom when administered to individuals who have been bitten. It's a life-saving therapy for those who have been bitten by venomous spiders and snakes. So while it may seem a bit strange to milk these deadly creatures, it's actually an act that saves lives. 
Every bit of venom collected contributes to creating the precious anti-venom that can be used in emergencies. Number 14. Here's a reason why you should always, and I mean always, look under the toilet, especially in a public restroom. This next incident happened in a restaurant, and it turns out that spiders, like many other creatures, need water to survive. Bathrooms, especially those with high humidity or moist environments, can attract spiders in search of a water source. Bathrooms often have hidden or undisturbed areas, such as corners, cabinets, or under toilet seats, where spiders love to find shelter. These areas provide a safe and secluded environment for spiders to rest and build their webs. Spiders are natural predators and often prey on insects. Bathrooms, especially if they have windows or openings, can attract insects like flies, ants, or mosquitoes. So spiders may be drawn to the bathroom to capture these insects as a food source. Number 13. Imagine this, you're walking through the forest and suddenly come across a peculiar door-like object on the ground. You become very curious and decide to tap it with a stick, and suddenly a spider jumps out. These are trapdoor spiders. These masterful architects of the spider world build ingenious shelters in the ground, complete with a trap door. The shelters lined with silk have a vertical tunnel, leading to a chamber where the spider resides. But this isn't just any door, it's a trap door. And this is where the true nature of these spiders comes to light. They're ambush predators, waiting in their shelters for the vibrations of unsuspecting insects or small invertebrates that pass by. At the slightest sense of movement, they spring out and seize their prey. Number 12. In this video, we see a giant bird-eating spider in the Amazon rainforest devouring an opossum. However, it's highly unlikely that spiders prey on opossums as they are typically much larger than the prey spiders typically hunt. These spiders mainly feed on insects, smaller spiders, and sometimes small vertebrates like lizards, birds, and rodents. There's documented cases of these spiders capturing prey as large as marsupial rats in the Amazon forest. So in this video, we witness an extremely rare moment when the spiders manages to overpower and consume an opossum. These spiders are highly adapted to their environment and have developed unique hunting strategies to catch their prey. They can also reach a body length of 4 inches or 10 centimeters, and a leg span of up to 11 inches or 28 centimeters. So the next time you venture into the Amazon rainforest, keep your eyes open. You never know what creature you might encounter. Number 11. A man named David Wheat, along with his children, came across a large nest of daddy long legged spiders somewhere in the woods. These spiders are known for their delicate, spindly legs, often much longer than their bodies. But here's a reassuring fact, they lack venom glands, and they primarily use their long legs to sense their surroundings and capture prey. However, David decided to stick his hand into the nest without fear and pulled out a bunch of resting spiders, tossing them on the ground. Despite their creepy appearance, these spiders are actually incapable of biting or causing harm. But still, the question remains, how much money would it take for you to stick your hand into a spider nest? Let me know in the comments. Number 10. Tarantulas are the largest spiders in the world and can easily cover your entire face. With as many as 900 species, they can vary in size, but most have a body length of about 3 inches or 8 centimeters and a leg span of up to 11 inches or 28 centimeters. The goliath bird-eating tarantula, however, takes the crown with a leg span of up to 30 centimeters. They're impressive creatures with robust bodies, hairy legs, and impressive fangs. They use their venom not only to immobilize prey, but also for defense. Some species, like the Brazilian wandering spider, have particularly potent venom that can cause severe reactions. Others raise their front legs threateningly, bearing their fangs. But biting? That's usually their last resort. Number 9. It was an ordinary day for Jackson Landers, a writer for the New York Times, until an encounter with a black spider turned his life upside down. It all started with putting on his boot. What he didn't know was that an unwelcome guest was inside. He described the bite as subtle, just a prick, but the consequences were anything but that. Before he knew it, he was in a wheelchair on his way to the emergency room, and his body was rebelling against the neurotoxic venom coursing through his veins. This black widow wasn't just any spider, it was a southern black widow, notorious for its potent venom. A bite from such a spider is no joke. The venom, a cocktail of various toxins, attacks the nervous system, leading to a range of symptoms. If you live in an area where these spiders are found, always check your shoes before putting them on. Number 8. The next person was at home looking at the ceiling and saw a nest of spiders with a gigantic mother spider behind it. They got the scare of their life and suddenly found themselves in a scene straight out of a video game. The creepy part is the gigantic spider that appears to be the mother of all spiders, hidden in the shadows of her web, surrounded by a sea of her offsprings. 
Imagine if you were this person and encountered this in your house. While it seems straight out of a nightmare, there's another side to the story. These huntsman spiders, with their various colors and patterns, play a crucial role in the ecosystem. They're heroes that can help control the population of various pets, such as cockroaches and flies. So as terrifying as they may seem, these spiders are actually allies in our daily lives. Number 7. This is the legendary Jabafofi, a mythical creature that is said to inhabit the dense rainforests of the Republic of Congo and other parts of Central Africa. The Jabafofi, better known as the Congolese giant spider or the living fossil spider, is shrouded in folklore and mystery. This giant spider, larger than a full-grown human, is said to have a leg span of around 6 feet or 1.8 meters or more. Its name, which means giant spider in the local Bantu language, conjures up images of a creature so terrifying that it seems to come straight out of a horror film. According to local legends and eyewitness accounts, the Jabafofi builds enormous, intricate webs between trees, and it's known for its aggressive behavior. This nocturnal creature hunts in the darkness, capturing small animals, including birds and mammals. But does this creature really exist? Or is it perhaps just an extremely large huntsman spider? Opinions are divided, but one thing is certain, the thought of this thing existing terrifies everyone. Number 6. Yvette Doth is the Minister of Health of Queensland, Australia, and during a press conference, she felt something crawling up her leg. While all the cameras were focused on her, she surprisingly remained calm. A massive huntsman spider was climbing her leg, unaware or indifferent to the gravity of the situation. With a mixture of amazement and mild concern, she exclaimed, can someone please take that spider off? The room filled with laughter, sympathy, and curiosity as everyone watched the situation unfold. The Huntsman Spider, notorious for its size and agility, provided a temporary interruption to the press briefing. While the woman received assistance, the spider quickly made its escape. Number 5. Imagine the horror of walking into a room, only to discover that it's become a breeding ground for a writhing mass of huntsman spiders. This happened to a family in Australia, where these spiders decided that a bedroom was the perfect place to welcome their new generation. Huntsman spiders, known for their impressive size and speed, are a common sight in Australia. They actively hunt, which means that each one of those little spiderlings hatching from a single egg sac is now on its own adventure in your home. An egg sac can range from dozens to hundreds of spiderlings. While the idea alone is enough to give you goosebumps, these spiders are fortunately not aggressive. Plus, they keep your home free of other unwanted pests. However, they are more interested in catching insects than you. Number 4 An Australian couple came home after a night out and saw a spider on their window, which was as big as a cat. Even their cat, usually the house hunter, recoiled in fear. However, this gigantic spider is no ordinary sight. Huntsman spiders, both admired and feared, are masterful climbers, incredibly fast, and can easily navigate vertical surfaces and ceilings. And now, in this house, it seemed like the spider had claimed its new domain, leaving the couple with no choice but to keep every possible entrance tightly shut. But here's the irony. Despite their terrifying appearance, huntsman spiders are often seen as bringers of luck in Australian folklore. They're known as shed spiders or garden spiders, and are appreciated because they control the insect population. Number 3. A YouTuber named Whitey Exotics focuses on exotic animals, particularly tarantulas, invertebrates, reptiles, and amphibians. He's driven by a lifelong fascination with the diversity of the natural world and has a great interest in arachnids and insects. In this video, he attempts to catch a venomous tarantula that had escaped from its enclosure located in one of his rooms. According to the man, this spider is one of the most dangerous in the world, so he must be very careful. As we can see, he brings a container to try to capture the spider, but it doesn't go quite as expected. Let's hope he eventually manages to capture the spider safely. Number 2. In this next video, a man from Russia wakes up, and as he looks out of his window, suddenly he sees a gigantic spider climbing the building across from him. This incredible moment took place in July 2014, and thanks to him grabbing his camera, we have the evidence. What he captured was truly astonishing. A gigantic spider making its way across a building so large that it seemed like it had escaped from a prehistoric world. Millions of years ago, in various periods of Earth's history, animals including snakes were significantly larger than their modern counterparts. These giant proportions were made possible by an abundance of food sources and an atmosphere rich in oxygen, allowing animals to absorb more energy and maintain larger bodies. But what would a spider this size eat in the modern world? Would it prey on large animals or perhaps devour small vehicles in one bite? While the answer to this question remains a mystery, it opens up a fascinating discussion. Number 1. 
The person in this video encountered a spider in his house and thought it was a good idea to crush the spider with his broom. However, he should not have done that. After he squashes the spider, suddenly hundreds of tiny spiders emerge. This phenomenon is known as a spider explosion, and it occurs when the mother spider, in this case a wolf spider, gets crushed. This allows all the baby spiders riding on her back to disperse. After mating, the female wolf spider carries her eggs in a silk sack attached to her abdomen. When they are ready to hatch, they stay in the sack until they reach their first stage. Once molted, they climb onto the mother's back. The mother spider provides protection and transportation for her offspring, allowing them to hitch a ride on her body. Are you afraid of spiders? Let me know in the comments. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos we've made, click one on the screen or take a look at the channel. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.